What's going on, you guys? Fat Kid Productions here. Uh, nothing much is really going on today. Um, but so I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys another story. Oi, the bathrooms infested with ants. Ugh. Anyway, so what's going on, you guys? Fat Kid Productions here. Today, nothing much is really going on, so I'm going to go ahead and give you guys another story. And this story is about the time my ex-girlfriend... Now, keep in mind, this is the same ex-girlfriend that almost got me arrested because of her stupidity. And, yeah, pretty much that. Well, I'm going to go ahead and tell you all about the time she committed stolen valor. Now, before I get into this story, I just want you all to know, if you ever commit stolen valor, you're a piece of shit. And for those of you who don't know what Stolen Valor is, it's where you put on a military uniform and pretend that you served when you really didn't. And, uh, well, I just want to put it out there. I hate those kind of people, especially my ex-girlfriend. All right, here's how it all went down. About earlier this, about maybe, maybe a couple of months ago, actually, this happened. Back in February, uh, I talked to my ex-girlfriend, one who almost got me arrested for her stupidity, and, well, she had a Navy uniform on because she moved to California, and that's how we broke up. And, well, she comes up to me in this Navy uniform, and I'm just like, oh, hey, you're in the Navy? And she's just like, yeah, yeah. And I'm just like, oh, okay, that's nice. And so I ask her, I say, what's, what's your MOS? And she's like, oh, well, uh, uh, I'll be right back. All right, sorry, I'm back, guys. I had to go greet some friends. Uh... My, well, no, Deacon's annoying friends, so... Well, no, his friend's mom. I had to go greet her. So, yeah, uh... Anyway, so... Oh, my God, these ants are still in my bathroom. So, she's wearing the, the Navy uniform. I was like, what, what was your MOS? And she's like, uh, uh, well, well, uh, uh. And I'm just like, this... Don't tell me. You're, you're not pretending to be in the military, are you? And she's just like, well, no, but, uh, 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 uh. And I'm just like, okay, take off the fucking uniform. What? Is it cool if we play the game? No, I'm playing it. Anyway, so sorry. Uh, anyway. I hate you. Biatch. Anyway, so, um, so I'm just like, oh my God, you're pretending to be in the military. And so I, I'm like, I get in her face and I'm just like, you better take off that uniform or I'm calling the cops. And she's like, oh, they're not going to do nothing. I'm like, uh, yes, it is. Stolen valor. And, you know, it was, it just pissed me off so bad. And it pisses me off so bad when people do that. And no, I didn't serve myself, but I tried to, and I didn't really succeed. I called a recruiter. They told me I couldn't join the military because of my autism. So, yeah. Uh, anyway, so... Anyway, so... I'm so, so she takes, she le walks away at this point. I'm just like, yeah, motherfucker. Anyway, so it also upsets me so bad when people pretend to be in the military because my dad was a veteran. So, so were my uncles, my grandfather from there on out. Yeah, it just, it just upsets me, you know, I hate it. And to all my subscribers out there, don't lie about being in the military just for recognition. And even if you are in the military, don't flaunt it around for recognition. You're in the military to serve. Yeah. Well, I guess that's it for today. Come and subscribe. Peace.